You better get your sports straight. You better get you better get your sports straight. Look it up. Google it, fool. Google it. Guess what? Welcome back to a new video. Don't hate the player, hate the game. Yo, don't hate the player, hate the game. We're out here today. Alexa, turn on the bedroom light. Okay. Look at what you did. Get out of here. Come on, leave. What did you do? You got mud all over the bed. Why? 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 Are you alive? Well, you're alive. What are you doing down there? That one just eats the ground. The ground. That one just eats the ground. He also eats poop. He's a poop eater. Man, there's my lenses, man. I really need to invest in a new lens. I don't know if I'm in focus or out of focus, but it's like every fisheye lens that I use for my Sony camera, I feel like it's broken. I don't know, you tell me in the footage. Or you tell me in the comments, because you're watching the footage. I just woke up, I have nothing planned right now except for drinking coffee. Welcome to my work week. Hello, how's it going? This is what we're doing today for a little bit. I'm cutting a sticker out for eBay and I'm getting some stickers ready out for somebody else with these stickers. When I got the vinyl roll, I don't want this vinyl roll to get stuck. So I'm gonna cut the vinyl roll. You see how it's, I hate it when they do that. When they roll it up so tight in the package and then when you get it, it's like a scroll and you're reading something from God. I don't like that. So I'm gonna cut some out and have it, I have this sheet right here. I don't know, hang on. Bought this roll of vinyl to make these stickers for these people. Rummaging around trying to find other vinyl because when I cut this vinyl off, it kind of like got sloppy. It got stuck to itself for some reason. So I was rummaging around and I found a whole sheet, a whole sheet of vinyl. I haven't skated at all this time. It's been like two or three days since I've been filming this video. Stuff has been going down and I haven't been going outside. I've been working on my computer for the last two days straight inside. So I've been trying to skate, but I haven't had time and I've been on the computer for like four hours yesterday, four hours today, maybe even longer yesterday, maybe like a whole eight hour day on the computer trying to get some stuff done for some t-shirts. And today I stayed on the computer for about four hours today trying to get some stuff done for some t-shirts. And I really want to skate, so the trick that I really want to do on the corner, if you haven't noticed, that been skateboarding the corner a lot and doing like manual tricks up the curb. So last time, uh, Brayden did like, he learned how to bunny hop into manual. So I was like, let's try the same trick. So he like, he learned how to bunny hop into manual. That's dope. So I was like, I'll get my manual tricks back. I had to learn it back, like manual up the curb. So manual up the curb, a kick flip into manual, I mean not kick flip, but finger flip manual up the curb. I was super hyped on that because it was first try out my thought process if I could do kickflip manual or not kickflip manual but finger flip manual I call it kickflip because that's the way I kickflip so if I can do the kickflip manual that way I probably could do like nollie flip manual because in reality if you think about it doing tricks standing still is okay I'm trying to like learn the trick standing still but like when you're moving and trying to do the trick it's a lot easier so my thought process is if I just stand here and try to do like nollie flip or standing still it'd be like switch flip into manual but like if I if I just stood here and did nollie flip into manual stall and if I get into the stall just a little bit It don't have to be perfect when I'm doing it right here If I can just get into it when I'm moving you can shift your weight while you're moving So shifting your weight standing still trying to do some stuff the ground is so rough around here In reality this would be nollie flip because I'd be going this way, but right now we're like in switch flip position weekend Saturday was it Saturday it took me five hours to pressure wash this off see if I land I know that one was I kind of landed and lifted up but I believe if I was rolling 
I can still, when I lift up, I can balance, balance it out. Cut up my old skateboards for a reason, because I was gonna burn them in my wood stove in my garage. Skateboarding is not easy. If you think about it, not everybody can do it. Discipline. There we go. You gotta have discipline to do it. Don't worry about the toilet in the corner over here because uh, summertime, I clean it up and I plant flowers in it. Coca-Cola today. I haven't. I don't never drink soda ever at all, and I drank Coke. Crazy, because it gave me the same feeling like when I used to drink Red Bull. I feel like a crackhead. Like if this is how a crackhead. Like I'm not trying to compare it to a crackhead. Maybe I am. Maybe I'm not. You might take it the wrong way, but we grew up in the era when there was crackheads around. There's still crackheads out there today. They're just underground. When I was growing up, skateboarding in the streets, hanging out with my homies, there was crackheads in the streets. It just depends on where you're skating and where you're hanging out at the time. But is this how it feels? It just feels I'm aware and alert. Or maybe, I don't know. Let me know. I'm not saying if you ever done crack, but it's just like, whoa. Or cocaine. Maybe that's the way it feels. It's like crazy. Coke, crack, it's all the same. Crack is just a rocked up form of cocaine. Yeah, but you you did it. That's that's a that was a good like warm up one. Yeah. All right, now I just gotta go to the drawing board. That's a old dried up banana. Easy. Ah.